um, continuing from my last video. I think I added too fast because this is 150. This is um, 210. So that is um, you minus 210 to both sides. So minus 210 here. You get 160. That's a negative 160. And um, you minus 72 minus 72 K that's why we got that equals to zero and then you factor right oh, what a big number to factor um, can't seem to get smaller than than this am I doing something wrong um, oh this is 50 K this times that is 50 K uh oh that changes that. Um, that changes that. I'm glad I found that. All right. So we get um, minus 72 K. We get 22 K. And then that didn't did I mess up somewhere else two four that's 60 I'm, che I'm double checking everything guys triple checking making sure okay gets 12k and that gets 60 Hopefully I didn't write anything wrong. Let me look at the problem again. Because I do like to write it wrong. Um, no, it looked like I wrote everything out right. Okay. All right. Then we, that's minus 210, right? That a, sure is a big number equals to zero to factor out. It's negative 400, 800, and 40. I must have done something wrong. Negative 22. Um, so 8 times uh, 1, 0, 5. That's not going to get it. Let's see. 20? See if twenty goes into that. Um, Eight forty divided by twenty. Forty-two times. Aha. Times forty-two. There we go. We got it. Twenty and forty-two. That's a negative forty-two. So factor by grouping. 4k squared um, and then negative 210 is the same factor by grouping center so we got plus 20k minus 42k okay and factor by grouping there by 4 factor out of 4k you get k minus plus 5 Okay, factor out a negative, um, wow, that could be a big one, 7, you get um, 8K plus 30, no, 7 times 6, 6K, 42, oh, I can factor out a 6. So basically, I can factor out a 42. Um, then I get k plus 5. Ah, that should escape me a symbol. I wasn't thinking, kids. So we got 4k minus 42. Okay. And k plus 5 equal to 0. 
So our possible answer is k, k equals to negative 5, and then 4, 4k minus 42 equals to 0, because 42 equals to 4k. Divide by 4, we get k equals to, I think they leave it as fraction reduced. By 2, you get 21 over 2. Ah, that's a possible answer on there, I see. Uh, negative 5 may be a extraneous solution because if we put negative 5 here, we get a, a denominator as 0. So this is not our answer, only k21 is. k number 10, so I hope that helps because, man, did I have to look hard. Number 10 without is t plus 9 over t squared minus 4t minus 3 over t, let me double check that I copied it right, equals to 1 over t minus 4. Okay, this can be factor out to um, t, I mean factor out of t, t minus 4. So your common denominator is, so I'm going to erase this and write that there so I don't get confused. t and t minus 4. My common, I'm going to multiply everything, okay that's number 10, don't let that be confused, by my common denominator of t, t minus 4. Okay, if I multiply this first one by that, it's the exact same thing, so both of them cancels out and leaves t plus 9, right? And multiply the second one, um, I have this t cancels out, I have negative 3 times t minus 4 there. Equal to this last one here. I have this cancel out. I have 1 times t is just t. And then you solve it. Okay, and you get t plus 9 minus 3t plus 12 equals to t equal to 0 by minusing a t. So we get, um, combine these two together, get 21 minus 3t equal to 0. Solve it for t. Hey, my negative 3t equals to negative 21. t equals to 7. Oh, that's letter H. And that's it, and you guys can do the rest. So I think you should be able to do the rest pretty well. That asks me tomorrow. Monday.